Hey, it's the Raw Traveler here again. Today's video is about this utility that you can download on the on the internet that simulates it simulates an iPhone. Actually, if you are a member of Bing Rewards. And uh, if you're like me, I have the option of doing 20 searches a day on Bing Rewards on a mobile device. Now, I do have a mobile device. I have a couple of them. But uh, I'm kind of lazy. I don't like uh, switching between my laptop <coughs> and my mobile device. So I installed this... Uh, little piece of software called a user agent switcher as you can see right here on the screen <clears throat> and to get there you go to the website called uh, it's chris c-h-r-i-s-p-e-d-e-r-i-c-k dot com chris pederick dot com and, uh, and this is the page you should see if you go there and it's called the user agent switcher and here he's got a picture of the menu and what we, you would see on the menu if uh, if you had it downloaded so he's only got I believe a version for Firefox <clears throat> I think Firefox is probably still one of the best browsers I think it's got more compatibilities even than Chrome and some of the other ones so it's, it's so at this point in time it's not perfect it does have its problems but I think it still has uh, it's one of the better browsers it does work I believe on uh, different operating systems Linux and Windows and also on the uh, Apple products so <clears throat> it's a good uh, browser across the board so that's why I use it and if you use Firefox then you can download this uh, user agent switcher so all you have to do is download it which is this first selection here you click on download Uh, I think that's all you have to do. You can download it here too. Download for Firefox. And there's the download page for Firefox. You just click here the Add to Firefox. And it'll add it to Firefox. Pretty, pretty simple. And then... <clears throat> it'll appear uh, in in your Firefox like here you go into <clears throat> the customize that uh, little icon it looks like this this little circle right there it'll be in this list of tools and features and then you could either move it up here to your toolbar or you can move it right here into the uh, I guess these are the tools so I prefer to have it up on my toolbar once you have it moved to your toolbar, I'm going to get out of the customizer. This is what it looks like. And see, it says default user agent. You just click on it. And you can set it to, uh, these are for Internet Explorer, which is interesting. So that, in other words, your Firefox could emulate an Internet Explorer 6, 7, or 8. Uh, I guess that's good for people who are building software. They want to test it in Internet Explorer and they don't actually want to have Internet Explorer on their machine. <clears throat> so that's a good way to do it. Uh, now you've got search robots. Not sure what this does. Google Bot 2.1, MSN Bot 1.1, and Yahoo Slurp. And then the third option is iPhone 3.0. So for example, if you are doing a Bing Rewards 
<coughs> search today and you wanted to start searching on an iPhone you just click on iPhone and then you type in Bing now Bing thinks that it's searching on an iPhone so you can search for something like here just search for the word test and <clears throat> the results are coming out and now Bing thinks it's on an iPhone so that's pretty simple uh, once you've done your searches on for Bing on your mobile device which in this case would be the iPhone then you can just set it back to the default user agent and then if I go back to Bing it's gone back to the default which is Bing thinking that I am now I'm now a, a laptop and no longer a mobile device so that's it very easy very convenient it's for situations where you either don't have a mobile device or you do have one and you're just kind of lazy and you want to do everything at once you want to or it's also good for people who are developers and they want to test some kind of <coughs> script or something and try it in a in a iPhone version 3 it's all here Hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe, like, comment, anything you want to know that uh, I haven't shown. Maybe there's another type of uh, simulator or emulator you'd like to try. Uh, I'm When I was searching for this one, I actually had tried a few others. This one seems to be the easiest one. Works really great. It works for Firefox. And uh, give it a try. Take care.